Last Sunday in Arrowhead, it was time to button down for both the Raiders and the Chiefs as once again they launched into tribal warfare. As always in this hard-fought game, the only way Marv Hubbard, number 44, could gain yardage was to load 16 tons of cheap defenders. On the other hand, only Kansas City's Jeff Kenny, number 31, could make any headway against the staunch silver and black defense. And he got most of his 124 yards through his own second effort. Kenny's inspired running led to two cheap field goals, which for most of the afternoon looked to be enough for victory. Because for most of the day, turnovers and mistakes painted the Chiefs and Raiders as two teams in search of defeat. The theory seemed to be, anything you can do, I can do worse. Subbing for arresting Ken Stabler, number three, Daryl LaMonica had six completions in nine attempts. Three to his teammates, and three to chief defenders, like number 48, Nate Allen, whose long return led to naught. Finally, in this battle of dullness and defense, defense finally made the difference when Jimmy Warren, number 20, filched this Lynn Dawson pass and wasn't stopped until he ran into teammate Otis Sistrunk. Warren's theft led to the only Raider offensive move of the day as Darrell went up top to the ever-present phantom of the end zone, Cliff Branch, number 21. The quick, deadly outburst gave Oakland victory number 11 in typical Raider Chief fashion, 7-6. to six.